Hi guys, today we are going to see a PowerShell command called start services and the start services was useful for starting a status of the service that is initiating a service and let's go to the help but if you see here this is the of the syntax and the description which is given for the help and there are so many syntax which is given here and it was uh, the synopsis also shows that it was used for starting more than one services and now we can go directly to the online help and if you see here there is also an aliases which is given here ASASB for the start service it will be given by default and you can use this by default that is a shortcut which was used for the start service command here and these are the syntax let's go directly to the help and here it was so let's open the power partial and let's execute so you need to keep in mind that only a service which was in a stop state can be initiated that is a starter so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do uh, check whether what kind of services are in stop state Uh, this kind of services are on the stop state so let's try this VSS I'm just going to check service name VSS so it was in a stop state so I'm just going to start the service name VSS So if you see here it is throwing some kind of weather so let's go for the server version and check out the status here So let's start the same service here. But if you see the service has been started successfully. So it is in a running condition, so let's start some other services like remote registry just check the status of the service status and stop status I'm just going to start it and it was successfully started so there's an running status mode so this is how you will use the start service command to initiate a service here and let's check out 
this command which is using the word of command so if you see here the start service display name and if you are using the what if here it will show you and when this command executes what it will happen what it will do which shows that what if it will perform the operation start service on the target this services that is a if it this service the services which was having a display name which was having the prefix and, and suffixes remote and this command will be executed on those services so this is how the what if will get to work let's go to the next example and this one was used for creating a list of services and here and what this uh, set service so this is also one of the main command and uh, I will tell in detail about this command in my next video and thank you for watching the video